All right, guys. So bad news. Camera cut out mid-recording. All I basically just did right now was show off some products. It was a pack of gummies and a graded five card. And I opened the Greninja V box. They're the V unions. I'm gonna need to reshow off all of this stuff though, considering that the fact that I'm not gonna reshow the video that just stopped for some reason. But there's the Greninja. Surprise, so got a little bit of gray. There you go, Greninja. Professor Burnett. Comes with these packs, two fusions, chilling and evolving. They're both showing off. Where's this box of gummies? CGC5, Mewtwo, base set. And I'm also opening this mini tin, as well as the Snorlax Slowbro V. And that's about it. Also, I just posted a video today involving this card. Go check it out. It's a great video. You guys will probably love it if you do love gold stars. But I hate it whenever my camera just cuts out. But let's get into the packs. Obviously, I'm using Shackle looking for the Espeon. Or another good one is the Mew Gengar, my personal favorite in the set. I've only pulled two VMAX Altarts. We pulled the Espeon, uh, Water Energy, and the Gengar. We I traded for the Inteleon, so all I needed is the Mew to have every single Altart VMAX. As, as for Altart Vs, I have not pulled the Genesect. I have pulled the Mew before. But I then traded the Mew. So, I don't really have any grits. Pico V Reverse is not bad. And a Luxray non hollow And that was a white border, okay. Because I remember one time I opened a box and the white and the black borders actually had, had no hits. But then I got a black border and it did have a hit. So that was weird. These are a little bit older boxes. So. Some people don't find these as exciting. But one thing I think I might do is open a Chilling Rain Booster box, considering they're only like $87, Fire Energy. They are pretty cheap right now, and the Altoids in the set are still really high valued. I personally do like them. Let's see how we get, come on. Look for something big, I wanna sleeve it. Tyranitar V, it'd be nice if this was about a size and this was an Altoid, that would be or I'd be like, oh my god, Tyranitar. But a nice Tyranitar V to start it off. That's semi good, semi bad. It could mean we don't have any more hits in these packs. Because you don't know how these boxes will react. Uh, okay, let's just crack it from the back. Oh wow, perfect. 54. Water. Darkness. Ooh, lucky energy. I'm gonna get that a lot. Why does it feel so thick? Boycon 2, Raboot, Deerling, Sneezeale, Galarian Farfetch, Furfru, Renipede, Beneath, and a Warring Non Hollow Hit. Chilling's got some, some pretty mediocre pull rates. I always double check to make sure the code cards were green and white. Because I always like to know. Should we just look at this one? I think for this one, let's just look. Okay. Three, two, one. Green code. Uh, I'll go lightning energy. Steel energy. Where did I put all the energy cards? Just stack energies right there next to the steel one. Did I put them in the stack by accident? I did. One, two, three, four. Yeah. All right. So this box is pretty disappointing. We only got a V. But you know what? That's all good. We got more stuff to open. Let's crack this tin. Camera back up. Try to stand it back up on all three. I do just use a Walmart tripod. I am not ashamed of it. So if I have a stuffy nose, I have been had a little bit of a cold. But gotta make the content. If I don't have products, I can't make the content. So let's hope these products can give us some content. Let's pull some alternate arts. Yay. There's the back of the tin. That's what all the arts would look like if I had them all. Cosmic up first. Rebel. 
three cone corn and the Obstagoon. These tins do not come with codes, but the packs themselves do. Let's crack through these. Start with the Clash. Obviously, Cosmic is a really fun set. And if you're looking for a booster box, about 500 bucks each. I think I go for the store bots and buy 36 of these tins. That is $10 a tin, 360 bucks for basically two booster boxes because you get a booster box of Rebel and Cosmic. I didn't guess the energy. Okay, the energy is up there. I thought I, I thought for some reason I put it back in the stack. If we're going to pull something, I'd like to see a boss's orders. Boss's orders rainbows are about 38 bucks each. That'd be a nice hit to see. Pink Eyes Gen V. I'll take it. Not bad. It was a white. Weave him up. Pink Eyes Gen V. Looks like he has a butt for his nose. Funny. Alright. Next pack. We're going to go Fairy Energy. Considering this is Cosmic. It's Rainbow. The Fairy Energy is in play here. Cosmic Eclipse. Let's make sure that code card's clear. There's going to be a lot of people who want that one. That's a good code card. For Fairy Energy. It was Steel. It's what kills fairies. So if you drop an anvil on a fairy, kaboom. This call fairy has always been unique to me. How it's an uncommon. Got Wilmer. Got an Onyx. Dermaru. Dead Pig. Karana. Pan Jam. No way! No way, guys. No way. No. No. Guys, I've been hunting this card. Not, no joke. Let's go. This is my first, I think it's my first rainbow tag team. Oh, and this is one of the best. Oh, centering is not good. I don't care. Guys, look at that. Oh my god, that is beautiful. Oh, I don't have a top loader. Oh, I didn't bring top loaders. Oh, he's going in the, he's going in the center of those. He is the holy grail. Look at that boy. Bro, if that was the altar, I'd freak out even more. This panchan looks very faded for reverse. It's very off center, top to bottom. Yo, let's go. Who cares about guess the energy? This is one of my best openings. Let's crack this tin. I wonder if I can make this better if I get a rainbow Zod. Because I'm pretty sure these tins have burning shadows. I'm telling you guys. No, the thing is, guys, is I bought is we bought four of those mini tins for each one of my family. And that was supposed to be my dad's mini tin, but he took the one that I was gonna film for a video. All I had was an Excadrill character rare. So he saved this video. Oh, you see that right there? That's Burning Burrows. Got two Vivids, Sword and Shield. And these are all originals, because you can tell by the faded of the, like the packs are darker. So these have better ports. Oh my God, that's freaking go, might. That is an amazing pull. Let's leave up the slow, bro. Man, that is a phenomenal pull. I, I actually can't believe it. Because that's Cosmic has some of the roughest pull rates, I feel like, that most people would say. And we actually pulled, like, one of the best cards in the set, I feel like. I know that, like, the Altoid... Um, like, the, the Altoid of that, and also the Rosa Full Art are some of the best ones. Uh, Lightning Energy. But you you can't be mad when you see a rainbow. God, I I still a rainbow rare out of one pack of cosmic this whole opening. Man. Amazing rare IQ. Quagsire. Bro. What is this luck? Like amazing rare IQ out of a vivid voltage. Let me guess. Got a surprised? It's a vivid voltage. It's a Twitch streamer, by the way. It's green code. See, most of the times you see a green code. Most of the times green code, I would just throw away. But these is amazing. It's amazing rare. Get it? I love the sparkle on these. It's all centered, but yeah. Do we think on the middle? I don't think we can put them in the middle, but we'll leave them in the front of the stack. Man, no reverse and quagmire from Family Guy. Man. 
Who is actually mad this opening, guys? Man. This is a phenomenal opening. Man, the only thing that's better is that Mewtwo Gold Star opening. When you guys see that video, you're gonna be surprised on how I obtained that. I will. Ex I, I think I explained it on the video. If I don't, I'll explain it in the video after this one. Because I can't explain it now if you guys haven't watched it. Because I think it's just now finished done. Let's keep going. Lightning. We don't need to guess the energy, but I think this might be a hit. Because I think when I press down, like as I told you guys with the Evolving Skies, it presses backwards if it's a hit. Why are these so badly centered? Did you know? Snorlax Hollow. This is good, because this is one of the best hollows in the set. I think it's like a $3 hollow. Like, not even joking. So that's a pretty good hollow. Gotta put him back up. Oh, wait, I don't know if I showed him off. And in case I didn't show off the Raikou. Yeah, but we're going to need to put the Raikou in the front still because it's one of the best normal hits. Guys, this tin's pretty good. We've gotten one green and one white, one hollow, one amazing rare. And now we have Thorn Shield base. One of the, probably one of the pretty good sets because of the Mani Full Art is one of the big chase cards. The golden Pokemon, Zashin Zamazenta. The Rainbow Snorlax, which is what I was chasing for a while. I pulled it in a Wawa and freaked out there. Uh, let's go Fire Energy. Grass. Don't know what me not want to say grass for some reason. That's usually been my call. Uh, go to energy. But, whatever. For there, I thought I stopped filming and I was going to be so mad. Poke Kid Reverse. I think we had Poke Kid earlier. Yeah, we did. Right there. Not bad. And the rare? It's the evil non-hollow. Okay. <sighs> Burning Shadows. We are going to look for this one. Because there is Gyarados in the set, and I do love Gyarados. So we could get a reverse hollow Gyarados, and that wouldn't make me upset. Three, two, one. Green code card. Wah, wah. Who can be mad? I, I, I don't really want to be mad. Let's go fire energy. Last pack. Can we guess it? We got it, boys. We got one energy in the video. Knock on wood. We get the next one in the next video. But we got a fire energy. Let's just see what the rare is. Where's a Weavile? Let's get this all through the pack. Because we could get a Gyarados for the reverse, and I'd be happy. Sometimes people get errors where the energy is actually a full white trainer. And a reverse hollow crow gunk. I can't be upset. Guys, that's gonna do it for today's video. Let's go over the hits. The biggest being this rainbow rare tag team, Arceus, Dialga, and Palkia. Next up, we got an amazing rare Raikou, as well as the Hollow Snorlax. The Slowbro V out of the tin. The Pink Kerchin, also out of the also out of the mini tin. Tyrannosaurus V out of the Greninja box. And then the Greninja promos, as well as the Professor Burnett promo. That got cut off, that you will not see me open that box in the video, but you'll see the packs open. Let's see the trash pile. Not even that big. We got that. But that's a lot of boxes. But anyways, guys, that is going to do it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Peace.